This is a quick presentation on the Apache Labs Anand G2 transceiver and the Thetis software-defined radio. On the hardware side, the Anand G2 has the following general specs. The architecture is direct sampling, uh, TCXO stability is noteworthy. The standard modes are the ones that they support, CW, SSB, etc. There are plenty of antenna ports on this hardware, and the frequency resolution is 1 hertz, and the power is 13.8 volts DC, like any ham radio, at 25 amps, reasonable. The current draw is 2.5 amps on receive and 25 amps on transmit. On the receiver side, the receiver architecture is direct down conversion. It uh, consists also of dual 16-bit ADCs, those are analog to digital converters, independent filter banks for each ADC, and uh, LNAs and frequency coverage, pretty wide ranging, and an attenuator of up to 30 dB. On the transmitter side, it's a direct up conversion transceiver and the uh, DAC resolution is 16 bits. Remember, this is the digital to analog converter. RF power is 100 watts PEP for SSB and the standard modes, including digital, 1 to 30 watts for AM and 100 watts for CW. Input output consists of audio barrel line in, DB9, SMA transverter, 3.25 millimeter barrel mic, CW key, headphones, and two powered speaker outputs. Mini XLR mic, RJ45 Ethernet LAN connector, two HDMI 4K video outputs, and two USB ports. So the NNG2 are very capable bit of hardware. On the software side, we have Thetis. Thetis is the name for a software-defined radio that is PC-based and was developed by the HP SDR project. Functionality, true dual receiver ops, complete digital signal processing chain, comprehensive spectrum and waterfall displays, user selectable and adjustable bandwidth for QRM reduction, noise blanking and noise reduction on a wideband basis. Now, these are two independent items that we'll see later in the demonstration here, and they are pretty impressive. Ops using CW, SSB, etc. Interface to digital modes, decoders for digital modes is a breeze. Digital modes being WSJTX, since they both run on a PC, they interface very, very readily. Extensive voice processing and compression for transmitter, transmitter operations. Transmitter linearization using pure signal. Pure signal is the, their name of implementing this technology. And the way I understand it, it is the leading uh, implementation of the technology currently on the market. Lastly, antenna diversity for weak signal enhancement and QRM rejection. So Theta software is an amazing uh, bit of software. It's uh, multiple, multiple use uh, applications here. So the configuration of, of what we have is the following. Uh, we have the two black boxes. Really one is the Anand G2, which truly is a black box, and the PC. Uh, the Anand has an antenna connected directly to it, has our power supply, 13.8 volts DC, and it has an ethernet cable. One GBPS is adequate, is uh, recommended to connect these two bits of hardware. The PC has got to be that, a Windows PC, and it runs the Thetis software-defined radio. So now that we know that, let's actually look at the Thetis software being uh, input a signal from an NG2 and see what the, uh, the different noise reductions and such sound like something like that but uh, uh what else so we'll get a facebook uh facebook page there too no roosters on there but it's just facebook.com search 3916 all right we're going to shut down the net logger right now because we're starting a new net it is the free wheelers and it's up here there it is net number right. one on the nets in progress your net logger tonight kd4bhg in the great state of alabama and oh net control tonight. 
Outside is going to be Jimmy KC0, MQS, ladies, gentlemen, barbarians.